A 7.8 magnitude earthquake hit Turkey and Syria early on Monday, killing about 300 people, injuring hundreds as buildings collapsed across the region and sending tremors that were felt as far away as the island of Cyprus and Lebanon. Turkey's disaster agency said 76 people had been killed and 440 injured as authorities scrambled rescue teams and supply aircraft to the affected area while declaring a level 4 alarm that calls for international assistance. According to the Syrian health official and a local hospital, more than 230 people had been killed and 600 injured in a government-controlled part of Syria, as well as the northern areas held by pro-Turkish factions. Turkish President Recep Erdogan, in a telephone conversation with the governors of eight affected provinces, had conveyed his sympathies and urged national unity. While Syrian President Bashar al-Assad reportedly held an emergency cabinet meeting to review the damage and discuss the next step. Reacting to the incident, the U.S. National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan said Washington was profoundly concerned about the earthquake in Turkey and Syria and they are ready to provide any and all needed assistance. Turkey is among the most earthquake-prone countries in the world, with more than 17,000 people killed in a 7.6 magnitude earthquake in 1999, while more than 500 people were killed in 2011. Please subscribe to this channel, News Pop NG, for more updates. Like and share the video and drop your comments down the comment section. I am Adero Kewuni. Thanks for watching.